Hi everyone. In this session, I'll talk about cloud security and Google Cloud Armor service. So cloud security is a very vast topic and require its own course. My intent in this session is to provide you just the right set of details for building a secured cloud application that we would develop as part of our production lab. For an application, there can be many security threats. For instance, that includes insecure APIs, APIs exposing sensitive information, wrong privileges provided on the servers that allows unauthorized access, common web exploits like cross-site scripting and denial of service carried out by automated bots, which tries to bring down or make your application unresponsive. And Cloud Armor is one of the services provided by Google Cloud that lets you protect your application and websites against denial of service and web attacks. It lets you create security rules and also provides predefined rules to help mitigate common web exploits like cross-site scripting and SQL injection attacks. And you can also configure rate limits to protect your application from certain IP address or large volume of certain requests. And as part of the production lab, we will configure, allow, or deny rules to test out this capability. And you can also set up adaptive production that models incoming traffic and usage patterns and set up real-time alerts if there is any deviation. And apart from Google Armor service, you should also be aware of cloud audit logs provided by Google Cloud. And Google Cloud Audit provides four types of audit logs, admin activity, data access, system event, and policy deny. And these logs provide granular details on who did what, where, and when within your Google Cloud resource. And for details, please refer to the documentation. So this completes a short introduction to Cloud Armor. In our next session, we will use all the concepts that we have learned to build a production gate application and deploy it securely on Google Cloud. Happy learning.